guys it is friday march the 31st happy friday mm, 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 mm. it is 10 49 and as you can see your girl is at her at home workstation why because my manager even though she is on vacation has her foot on my neck okay she won't let up i'm like girl what did you do you just sit down did you take a day off just because like why is you my baby leave me alone we we supposed to be on vacation <laughs> anyway you guys i just wanted to say good morning uh we do have a full day today we have some orders that we need to pack and drop off to the post office we got to go to the grocery store come back home clean out the pantry and the refrigerator of course just the basic housework i do have some laundry that i need to fold so on and so forth oh and we're also going to get a workout in today i got to find time to cram all that in in like the next four to five hours because i would like to come home and just kind of relax chill medicate because we still trying to push sister bronchitis out okay the system and get a little bit of editing done so that's the plan for today i'm gonna stop rambling with you guys because sis keeps on coming she keep coming back to back with the emails y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and go i'll tap in with you guys a little bit later. We are done with our workout. I barely drank any of my water because um, I was kind of full from this turmeric water. So I need to make sure I drink that before I leave the house. I'm just about to start my dryer and set my alarm. Whew, okay. So now that that is done, we gotta go ahead and get cleaned up. I just checked my email and baby, they still sending work, but guess what? I got stuff I gotta do, okay? And it ain't sitting here at this here computer all doggone day. So I'm gonna go ahead and get myself, I'm looking down you guys because I am um, trying to open up my email to see what they sent. Okay, yeah, mm-hmm, y'all can send it baby. I got things I gotta do. I'll take care of that in a second. I just wanted to let you guys know that the workout is complete as you already saw. I feel good. Um, yeah, I feel I feel really, really good. Off to get cleaned up and I'll see you guys in a bit. What's up y'all, it is 1.02. I'm definitely not gonna play around with my job. That's my microwave. I'm heating up some leftover pizza so that I can put something on my stomach before I hit these streets. Um, and I'm also going to go ahead and do uh, this request real quick for this invoice Whoa. before I leave. I got feelings for you. Hope you ain't loving the crew. How many bodies you got? Prayer ain't more than a few. Know that you dealt with some lames when you was young and in school. He had to pop your chair, but I got it wet like a pool. She got a new G-Wag. She want to hit highlight room and show it off. Got a new body, girl, show it off. It's a Brazilian, I know it's all. Toned up and she got a six pack. Look like she used to play volleyball. American Express, you can have it all. Call to the safe, you can have it all. It is 1.55 and your girl is finally out and about in the streets. The first stop is the dollar store. I feel so good 
you guys the dollar store run is complete i think coming here to the dollar store first saved me a little trip um to but no i still gotta go to the grocery store i was gonna say it, it saved me a trip to the grocery store but i ended up finding some coffee which i desperately needed because y'all my little coffee station at home looks so poor like it looks so sad i only have 2k cups left so hopefully zay and bay will enjoy the coffee that i selected um i got the um the car the starbucks caramel which we've had that before so i know they'll like that one and then i got a new one that we hadn't tried before so fingers crossed child that don't go to waste um and then i got a couple other things i'll show you guys once i make it to the house excuse me i also picked up a pepsi even though i don't know why because i have this seven up here so something not gonna get drunk honey and i think it's gonna be this pepsi i'm just gonna put it in uh the bag and just take it home and put it in the refrigerator because i forgot all about that um seven up child when i'm out shopping spending money or whatever i get thirsty i don't know about y'all but i get thirsty Hey y'all, I'm here in Five Below. I wasn't planning on coming here, but I need like a cold pack that goes into a lunch kit. So hopefully I can find that here. If not, I'll just grab some incense because I do need those and I'll head out. So let's see if we can find what I'm looking for. I'm not, so long as you joking, now in for me. I ain't got it. I've been skimming, looting, hide your body. As so long as you dreaming about me, ain't no problem. I don't got nobody just with you right now. So the truth, I look better under you. I can lose when I'm with you. How can us lose and miss the moment? You just too important. Nobody, nobody like you do. I so we
don't know what I want to eat. Um, I decided to ixnay chicken salad chick because I, mm, the traffic was too crazy where I am. I'm not finna further, you know, <laughs> afflict myself by going deeper into traffic further away from where I need to be just for chicken salad chick. I might have to just holler at her next week. So she gonna have to miss me for another seven whole days and then I'm gonna be back to pick her up, hopefully. Okay, if the Lord says the same. Uh, but I just wanted to check in with you guys so far. Oh, there go a dollar store right there. Look at God. Look at look at how God operates. Man, I was just saying to myself, I am sick of these streets and I am ready to go home. Okay, the street life is not for me anymore. Okay. I was enjoying it for a little bit, but now I'm ready to go home. And God delivered, okay, with this awesome blessing. I'm showing finna whip up in there and see what they got going on. I don't think I've ever been to this dollar store before. Hmm. But we're going today. We is going today. Cigars on ice. Feeling like an animal with these cameras all in my grill. Flashing lights. Flashing lights. You got me pity, 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 baby, I want you. So, because I'm not familiar with this location, I don't know where what I need would be. Hmm, cozy place. I seen this in the other dollar store, y'all. This smells so freaking good. Let me know in the comment section down below if y'all have tried them. Hmm. Okay, tranquil waters. That smells real good. What is this one? Vanilla bliss. Mm. Okay, we might have to check them out. They also have some plugins as well. I don't know whose brand is this or whose brand this is. I don't know. Y'all know what I mean. And they also have room spray as well. Hmm. Interesting. Ooh. Okay. And they have a wax mouth. All right. See, this is how come I end up getting sidetracked. Let me find this dog on cold pack. I'll pick y'all back up. Okay, I ended up finding. I'll tell y'all about her in a I ended up finding what I need. So I'm going to get two of these. And I also want to see what kind of lunch kits they. Oh, here they go down here. Okay. Okay. Hmm. 28, I have that one. I need a whole ice chest. Hmm. It'll just be me and Zay tomorrow. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and roll with these and get a Can keep your eyes off my daddy. I want you. Drunk in love. The second trip to the dollar store is done. Y'all, I really, really like this dollar store. Like, it's nice. It's big. It's clean. Um, it's organized. Okay, no bins. Okay, come on through somebody. If you know, you know. Um, but, oh, it's the customer service that was really lacking. The customer service was really, really lacking. So, old girl in the back um in the section where i was able to find the coal pack sorry y'all i'm looking I'm trying to make sure i don't get hit y'all uh so the lady that was in the section by the coal packs or whatever you know hold yourself down baby hold yourself down um you know she was an employee now when i walk up on people right i could be knowing full and well that it's a high probability that you an employee However, I don't make the assumption. I always like to ask why, because I have been places where people have assumed I was an employee somewhere and I wasn't. And it kind of pissed me off because I'm like, the least you can do is ask, right? So I walk up on a lady, you know, excuse me, do you work here? Sis ain't say nothing. She ain't say not a thing. I saw she had her little apron on. I didn't catch that she had the apron on at first because when I said, excuse me, do you work here? Her back was turned to me, but she was kind of like dabbling around in the little bins or whatever. So I figured this much, right? So she ain't say nothing. I'm like, okay, well, you know, do, 
would you by chance know if you guys have any cold packs and if so where would they be sis ain't say nothing she was just like what well, she did say something she was like yeah and just proceeded to just walk up <sighs> people like her make it real hard to have manners and be considerate and not make any assumptions i could have just walked up to her, no hello no do you work here no nothing and just start demanding where stuff was because you got your little apron on and I sh I'm expecting that you should know anywho aside from that the only other weird encounter that I had was this customer man that was literally following me around when he noticed me um he was just following me around when we got in line he was in line first he saw me standing behind him I got out of line to see if I could find something that the other dollar store didn't have I was able to find it to God be glory um and he got out of line and as i'm reaching for what i need on an aisle that ain't nowhere near the line honey i look up and he just he was looking and then kind of scurried away i'm like yo come on man come on dude first of all i'm married even if i wouldn't even if i wasn't married you would not stand a chance in fiery hell okay let's just to put it mildly and nice beat it okay let <laughs> Let me just shop in peace. Men, if you single out there and y'all having to stumble across this and you see a woman that you find attractive, don't be weird about it, okay? First of all, check and see if she's married, okay? See if she got a ring on. If she don't, ask her if she's married. But don't be walking around here being all weird and whatnot because he was literally like scoping me out from the end of the aisle. Anyway, um, per usual, Dollar General do not disappoint when it comes to new snacks. I picked up this new Mountain Dew. They had two mountain dudes that i've never seen before this one and another one and i wanted to be greedy and get the other one but i'm like you know what i i just need to at least walk up out of here with some sort of self-control so i'm only getting one instead of two this is the mountain dew pitch black don't know what the hell is, <laughs> what the hell is gonna taste like child i mean if i had to just go off of what it looks like i'm i'm hoping great okay because i don't mind a good grape soda uh 280 <laughs> god Dang, 280 calories if you can, sis. I clearly don't because I picked it up. Didn't even check the nutritional facts. This is what the nutritional facts are on the back in the event you're interested and want to pause the screen to check them out. But my God, 280 Mountain Dew? Gosh, you're killing me, Petey. What is this Pepsi? Not me collecting cold drinks, knowing full well I got a whole pantry full of cold drinks. But this one is 250 if you're interested. Golly these bottles is high as hell but anywho let's go ahead and try this mountain dew pitch black cheers yep it's giving grape by high blast it's good i like it oh let me get another little swing Yep. 10 out of 10 recommend. And shout out to Mountain Dew for all of the new flavors that I've been seeing periodically when I'm paying attention and actually looking uh, in the little, you know, cold drink section or whatever. Uh, I like that. I like that. They've been on the market for quite some time. And uh, it's very refreshing and nice uh, to see that they're coming out, you know, with new flavors, trying to keep up with everybody else and they mama they got cold drinks. But anyway. When I tell y'all I made it to this dog on post office by the hair on my chin, and sis ain't got no hair on her chin, so I barely doggone made it. But shout out to my two good sisters here on YouTube, Sincerely Africa. I'll put her channel here. As well as my good sis over at the Q fam, I'll put her channel here. Thank you guys so much for purchasing with Love L. I greatly, greatly appreciate both of you guys so very much. And I pray that you guys enjoy the items that you purchase. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about, because this is your first video with me, I do own my own hair care company, Love L Hair Care. I always have it linked down in the description box below. I'll also put up just a little snippet of our website right here 
and I'll also put our web address on the screen. If you are so inclined, please feel free to check us out. We do uh, hand make and formulate all natural hair care products that will do your hair and scalp real good. I'm talking about real good. Anywho, I am on my way now to possibly get something to eat. I don't know, I say possibly y'all cause I really wanna go home, but the only thing that's waiting on me to, when I get home is a meal to cook. And I really don't wanna do that. I, I don't really wanna do that. I am by a Burger King and although Burger King is not my first choice, mm, I might make an exception and stop. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna go ahead and call Bay really quickly to see if he wants something and I'll pick you guys back. Uh, yes, ketchup, and can I have uh, two zesty sauce, please? Thank you. Sauce, onion, onion, milk, 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 okay, bitch. That's good. What? Yeah. You like it? Mm hmm It's like a grilled cheese whopper. Okay, your girl is good and fat full, ready to relax. But before I do that, let's go ahead and haul the 50 lemon items that I got from the 100 million stores that I went to today. Lego. All right, here are my pickups from the grocery store. First things first, I got some honey maple turkey. They printed out the wrong label yet again. I was watching them like a hawk this time and saw them pull the turkey. For some reason, I guess the code is similar. Um, and lately, they've been putting the ham. You guys know that they did the ham uh label last week and it had me concerned child had me running around calling folks and whatnot but this is turkey i also saw this on the end cap and decided to give it a try this is the beef jerky uh jack links but it's in the flame and hot flavor i bought that so that isaiah and i can try it we ran out of parmesan cheese so i picked some more up i also got this concord grape wine I needed some more sandwich bags, so I got some. Even though I picked up two boxes of coffee at the dollar store, this one is Isaiah's favorite. So I just went ahead and picked it up in the event he doesn't like uh, either one of the two that I picked up from the dollar store. I also picked up husband this Santa Fe salad with chicken. So it has like the cabbage, carrots, chicken, corn, and then it has cheese as you can see there. So he'll take this on the road with him. I also got some matzo style uh, squares because the Passover is coming up in a few days, hence why I got the crackers and the wine. Um, even though we'll be going to church and we'll receive the Passover at church, we also have to have the unleavened bread for seven days thereafter. And the wine is just something really for me to just sippy sip on. <laughs> I ain't even for the cap to you. Anywho, I also picked up some of Isaiah's current favorite chips, which is the flaming Hot Cool Ranch. And these are my current favorite, which are the Wavy Lays. Uh, this is the Funyuns flavor. All right, next up, I have the items that I got from both trips to the dollar store. So starting over here, I picked up two of the small trash bags, the vanilla scent. I got these on the dollar aisle. They were both just a dollar. I also needed some tire shine for my car, so I picked that up. You guys know that I am on a skincare journey or whatever, so I needed to get some small containers to store my DIY face wash. 
I also picked up a hella lot of <laughs> these Sweet Smile gummy bears. So we have a couple bags of the neon gummy bears, a couple bags of the gummy worms. And then I also picked up these Fruity Chews. Shout out to Beauty and the Beast. I'll put their channel on the screen here. You guys go over to their channel and show them some love. I was watching their vlog last night and they were in Big Lots and Beauty and the Beast saw um, some Kool-Aid Pop Rocks. And so I was telling them in the comment section that the dollar store also sells Kool-Aid candy as well. And this is one of the variety that they have. I also picked up two of these ice packs for our lunch kits. As I was going to the checkout, I saw that Sunkiss has these smoothie bars, pina colada, berry, strawberry, banana, and mango. So I'll let you guys know what I think about them. And it comes with 10 freeze and eat bars. I also needed some more nose and face charcoal strips, so I got that. I wanted to go ahead and pick up some more water shakers because we were running low. So I got a pack of Tang and then I also got a pack of the Zero Sugar Kool-Aid. I also picked up this Starbucks K-Cup Caramel with smooth and buttery notes coffee. I'm sure Isaiah and Paul is gonna love that. And this is a first time pickup. This is the Dunkin' French Vanilla. I'm not a Dunkin' girl. I've actually never had Dunkin' coffee before. I think my husband picked up some K-Cups before for our Keurig, but I never tried it. So I'll be sure to try this coffee and let you guys know what I think about it. And these are the items that I picked up from the dollar. Here are my pickups from five below, just these two little measly items, child. But I went ahead and got this little small spray bottle. I'm gonna use this instead for my face wash instead of the two bottles that I got from the dollar store and I'll just figure out something to do with them. And then I also got these incense. And lastly, here are my CVS pickups. So I'll go with the Nivea first. It was buy one, get one 50% off. I have my receipt here. So that's the noise that you hear in the background. Uh, so I ended up paying $6.49 for one. And with the 50% off discount, I got the second one for $3.24, making my total $10.53 with tax for both of these Nivea body wash, which is pretty good. I just bought some, but I just decided to go ahead and pick up two more while they're still on buy one, get one 50% off sale. But these for Breeze, baby. This is indeed the deal of the day. So these retail for $4.99 a piece. At CVS, it was buy one, get one 50% off. Plus there was a $3.30 off manufacture coupon on top of the buy one, get one free. I'm sorry, buy one, get one half off. So together for both of these air fresheners, I only paid $4.52. So literally with the manufacture coupon and the buy one, get one 50% off, it's like I got one for free. I bought one and got one for free instead of buying one and getting one for 50% off with the manufacturer coupon. That's a steal because one of these cost almost $5. So I think I came up and I might even go back to CVS uh, before the sale ends to get two more of these. It is 7.03 and your girl is winding down for the day. I did want to show you guys that I went ahead and made some of my DIY facial cleanser or facial wash and I went ahead and put it in these two containers. So all I'll do each time before I use it is shake it up and I'll spray this one and then I'll probably just use this as a refill bottle for this one because honestly with it being such a loose texture or consistency rather um it's just very messy and you end up wasting more product than you need to uh trying to put it in your hands and then putting you know washing your uh face with your hands so this will be what i use and i'll keep you guys updated on how i like this spray bottle but that is it you guys i hope that you enjoyed this vlog thank you so much for hanging out with me if you stuck with me for this long please be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button to join the fam and hit the post notification bell so that you never miss another one of my uploads and i will see you guys in the next video Bye.